I'm this one over here. When you grow up in rural Ohio. They were just hardworking farmers. You get a different view of the world. That's our first child. Open skies and stars you can name. You see one, you want to see them all. Laverne Beiser was hooked after witnessing his first solar eclipse in 1963. Now he's ready to see his 13th eclipse and at the age of 105. Not a puff of smoke, not a sip of liquor, not a drug of any kind, lots of chocolate milk, lots of good. <laughs> Laverne is an amateur astronomer. He became a mechanical engineer and worked on planes. He could take wood and make wonderful. I made that, that bed, bed. Like furniture, telescopes, but neither is his first love. That was back in 19... 19- 45. Laverne didn't just make things, he made memories. She was smart and beautiful. What he can't remember he can find in his closet. Marion said she would marry me. Yippee. Marion Beiser is his wife of 78 years. She died last year. I miss her a lot. We were always together. She saw all of them too. They traveled the world to see the eclipse, planned all their vacations around them. This time will be the first total eclipse without her. You'd be sorry that she wasn't there with you. For the first time for Laverne Beiser in North Texas, the eclipse is coming to him. Oh, I wouldn't miss it for anything. And he'll be with family. Yeah, enjoy the moment. That's it. Enjoy the moment. He also won't miss a chance to be engineer. Take two paper plates and a pencil. And astronomer all at once. Let the sun shine on the other one. That's not a a point of light. That's a picture of the sun. This total solar eclipse won't happen in Texas for another 300 years. Laverne says live in the moment. Drink it all in. Nothing better than that in the whole world. And don't forget the chocolate milk. I would have a beautiful, caring wife, too. That helps. (laughs) In North Texas, I'm Jobin Puniker.